Leanna McLean with Metroland Media Group, and today I'm with Peter Vega from uh, the Supervisor for Waste Operations. Peter, can you tell me a little bit about this uh, curbside collection program that we have for batteries today? Yeah, what we uh, what we're doing is we're collecting uh, batteries uh, from the household and we you know, you know, batteries something that doesn't belong in the landfill. Um, so we figured we'd uh, we'd start a curbside collection uh, pilot to see how it would go. Uh, we've timed it with the uh, change in the times with the with the fire department's program for changing batteries. So we figured it'd be a good thing to happen in the springtime and the fall. So we mailed out special orange bags to every household in Durham region, and uh, last week, and we asked everybody to fill fill the bag with the batteries that they have and put them in their blue box for this week's collection. So this week, throughout the week, we're collecting all the batteries, and we'll do it now, and we'll do it again in the springtime. batteries are collected and they're stripped down, what are the metals used for then? Well the metals, um, the metal, they get shredded and, and uh, separated into the metals and the component parts inside. The metals go into uh, cars and, uh, and other things that we make metal out of. Uh, the internal components, the, uh, the, the uh, manganese and the, and the, uh, the carbon on the, the insides actually get turned into fertilizer. Wow. And then the, uh, there's, sometimes the, some batteries have that, that plastic and paper uh, covering on the outside. Right. That'll, that'll go to, uh, to an incinerator in, uh, in Buffalo. Now, what's your guesstimation as to how many um, pounds or kilos that you'll be collected by the end of today? At the end of today, we're well. We're trying to break a Guinness World Record today, and the existing record uh, is 400 pounds, 14 ounces. It didn't take long for Durham Region to break the record for most batteries collected in a 24-hour period. As of 9:15 a.m., some 450 kilograms, almost 1,000 pounds, had been collected and delivered to the waste transfer station on Gerard Road in Whitby. And now, from my understanding, this is the first curbside um, battery collection in all of Durham or all of Ontario? This is the first uh, major municipality, Durham's the first major municipality to do a curbside collection like this in all of Canada. Okay. Uh, there's the, I think there's, there's a smaller municipality in Niagara that started one as a pilot project, uh, but as a large-scale municipality, we're the first. Okay, so Peter, who are you working with today? Well, we're working with our collection contractors, Miller Waste Systems and Green for Life. We're working with um, RMC, Raw Materials Corporation, which is the in Port Coburg, which is the company that's actually going to be recycling the, uh, the batteries. We're working with Indico Manufacturing, the local company here in Pickering that actually made the, uh, the bags we distributed to everybody. Uh, we're working with Stewardship Ontario, um, which is the uh, organization that's uh, overseeing the uh, hazardous waste program in Ontario. And uh, we're also working with um, Covanta, our uh, energy partner for the incinerator. Thank you so much, Peter. This is a great program that you have here. Good luck. I hope you break this Guinness World Record. This is Leanna McLean with Metroland Media Group.